prices keep rising over a period of time and you pay more for the same. Let us understand this by seeing how your breakfast cost has changed over time. In 2010, a breakfast would have costed you Rs 45, but now the same would cost you Rs 75. Such an increase in prices is called inflation. But what is the effect of inflation? As prices go up, it indirectly means that the value of your money has gone down. Let's say you have rupees 1 lakh at your home kept idle. With an annual inflation rate of 7%, the value of this rupees 1 lakh keeps falling over time. And after 30 years, its value would have fallen by 86.86%. Thus, inflation eats up the value of your money. What is the effect of all these on your investments? Let's assume that this pizza is the return on your investment. Most of us think that this is the return that we get. But as inflation eats into your return, the actual return is much lesser. Thus, what you actually realize is the return adjusted for inflation, also called as real return. Let us look at nominal returns for various types of investments. After we consider the effect of inflation, now we see the return that is net of inflation, also called real return. We see that traditional investment classes like gold and fixed income fail to beat inflation and achieve a decent return.